what's up guys and today we got a dual review between collins and hargrave now the reason that i picked these two up was because of their they're a finesse move because you know that that debate between power move and finesse move and finesse move being so much better for pass rushing so i decided to pick them both up and see if they could get on the same levels as you know javon curse so the first one that I wanted to check out, of course, was Hargrave because, you know, he's the higher overall. And on paper, he's a little, just slightly better than Collins. But still, you see right here, from what I could tell, if you put him at defensive end, he is a little bit better at pass rushing for, you know, whatever reason. Now, his overall drops to a 93, which is not a terrible drop, you know, from a 94. But just in terms of pass rushing I'm talking about, he was slightly better now of course right here if you put him at defensive tackle if you leave him there he'll get uh, some you know nice animations but just overall i think a better pass rusher at the end now when it came to tackling a pretty solid tackler i believe he had like four or five solo tackles i think the only one that got away from him was the uh, jordan howard card that broke like one tackle but you know we all know jordan howard is pretty damn good at breaking tackles regardless but overall a solid tackler now Collins on the other hand was definitely a better tackler you know he was better at pushing the center or the guard whoever it was you know to the left or to the right depending which way the run was going and really disrupting the run or sometimes even you know pushing the center backwards and really killing the run not that Colin or that um, Hargrave couldn't do it too but def I definitely saw better work from Collins than Hargrave and the same could be said for pass rushing I mean I definitely saw better pass rushing moves from Collins and Hargrave from the defensive tackle spot I try to put Collins at the end he was just not as good as Hargrave but unfortunately none of them were really phenomenal when he can to pass rush and I had really high hopes that one of them like would just like shine as bright as Javon Curse just from what I could tell it just was not there at all so that's gonna wrap this up guys and they both go between 15 and 60k not too bad and you know, like I said, I have really high hopes. I was hoping because of that finesse move, which is pretty high, I was hoping that they'd be on the same level as Javon Curse, but it just wasn't the case. And I know you're going to think I'm crazy, but the ultimate freeze and Dominic and Sue was, I think, a better pass rusher than both of them, believe it or not. I can say that with confidence. But anyways, guys, I'll see you guys for the next review, man. We should be Wallace. Peace.